All right, guys, it's Dom D. Calx, and this is the first video in the Kramer series. Um, so we're going to start off with Kramer 2. So this is for the 2x2. Two two. So um, you'll need to go to a different one of my videos and watch it, and you'll need to make program clear and unclear. They're pretty simple annotation link, uh, however you need to get there, but you need to get that program because I use it a lot, or both of those programs because you'll need both. So, um, after you set that, display, display input coefficient of x, input a, input coefficient of y, input b, input answer, input c, so that's actually asking for it and storing what you put in as c. Uh, same thing here, this is just for the, the second equation, input coefficient of x, y, and the answer. And then right here, it's doing the math. Um, as you can see, storing it as G and then as H. And then this right here is getting the greatest common denominator of G and H and storing it as 1. That allows you to reduce the fraction into the simplified form so that you don't have to do anything. And then you divide G and H by what the greatest common denominator or the greatest common factor was which you store as i, and so thus, and then you store them as g and h again, and so you have the most simplified form of g and h. Then um, put text, 1 comma 1, x equals g over h. Pause. Um, this is doing the math for the second part, and again, storing, it, storing the math as j and k, finding the uh, greatest common factor of J and K, storing it as L, uh, then J over L, K over L, stores J, stores K, those are, so those are the simplified, or they're as simplified as they can be, then it displays Y equals J over K, uh, pause, then you need to put program clear in here, and then return, and that brings you back to um, the main program, which all these programs work off of. Thanks guys, see you next time.